Hey, welcome to this video. Uh, today we are going to review the Techno Spark 3. I have it right now in my hands. So we are going to look through and see the specifications, the speed and the processing power. Let's get started with our video. This is the nice phone as you see it has a great a great body as you see uh, we have a glass back here and the display here it's very clear although it has a high ref reflect reflective so at the bottom we have the speakers this is the speaker right here it's not very clear. We have the speaker, we have the micro USB port, and we have the microphone. It's very tiny, you can barely see it, and the headphone jack. So, moving to the right, we have the power button and the volume keys. So, we have the front camera, front flash, and the earpiece. default home screen as you know android is always customized you can customize each and everything it's user friendly so uh, this phone has internal uh, storage of 32 gb 32 gb uh, it has ram of 2 gb as you can see uh, it has a very good user interface as you know android is always user friendly you can customize it so it's pretty fast as you see you can cast multitask more pops at the same time so let's talk about the, this, the display uh, we've got a thick bezel here and very thin bezels at the sides as you can see, you can see. then we have a top notch uh, these are some new display features the top notch as you can see we have the notification center and the network area so this is the display it's pretty decent as you can see this is a great piece of hardware as you can see uh, it's pretty friendly uh, and the price is at least a good at a good budget you can buy one at 350 i think or at maybe 450 shillings thousand shillings sorry so this is the phone uh, let's first see the speakers uh, and we will we'll head to the to the other other item uh, let's see let me open a, a song here this is the file system music. Let me play one song here. Let me see the speaker. So it's pretty loud, uh, very audible. You can listen to great music here. Yeah? So the display is really attractive, as you can see. It's very bright. So this is a great phone. It's even better than the than its its successor, the Spark 4. So if you're wishing to buy a Spark 4, I recommend you should buy a. Factory. So this is my this is the end of my video. Thanks for watching.